Good morning, Chattooga. It's always a great day to be a Chattooga Indian. Thank you for joining us on Smoke Signals TV, where we'll bring you all the information you'll need to be the best Chattooga Indian that you can be. First and foremost, let's start the day by saying the pledge of the American flag. Please stand. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Please pause for a moment of silence. Georgia Cooper has been accepted as a semifinalist for the Governor's Honors Program. She will participate in the state-level GHP interview for agricultural sciences on February 24th at Berry College. Congratulations, Georgia. The Young Georgia Authors Writing Competition is in full swing. If you would like to submit a poem, essay, or short story, please see your English teacher for more details. The final day for accepting entries will be February the 14th. Congratulations to Megan Perry, who was named area finalist in the prepared public speaking for FFA. She will compete in the region competition in March. The CHS athletic trainer is looking for students who would like to work with him and the sports medicine team in the upcoming school year. Applications are in the front office and should be returned to the training room in the gym by Friday. Seniors, Miss Wallace has applications for the Rotary Scholarship and Menlo Line Club Scholarship. These applications are due February the 6th. The Miss Chattooga County pageant will be held on Saturday, March 24th. The entry fee is $30. See Miss Hartline for an entry form. SCA has set a goal to have 50 students at the meeting on Friday, February the 9th. The FCA huddle meetings are on Friday mornings in the gym at 7.15. Everyone is invited to attend. SCA will host a free movie on Sunday, March the 18th from 2 to 4 at the CHS cafeteria. Drinks and popcorn are for everyone. Work-based learning students need to meet Ms. Hughes during their work period in her office Thursday, February 16th. Any student, boy or girl, wanting to play golf, please see Coach Lanier. Varsity boys won against Kusa Tuesday night, 70 to 56. Clayton Johnson led the team with 15 points. Devin Price had 14. Jamarius Mosteller had 12. And Glenn Walker had 11. Varsity girls also defeated Kusa on Tuesday, 53 to 49. Taylor Melton led the team with 22 points. J.C. Martin had 12. Varsity teams will play at Gordon Central on Friday at 6 p.m. Let's go. Do you tell me how Kevin can grow up on meat love? Peas, mashed potatoes, green carrots, and fruit. And if I ever have peas or fish sandwich. You listen to the latest news and announcements from Chattooga High School. Thank you for joining us on Smoke Signals TV. I'm Hamp Thomas. Have a great day and try pride.